It's Monday. The kids aren't here. So it's quiet. So we decided that we needed to clean our junkie house. It's like junkie everywhere. You see Aries in the back over here cleaning the fan. So we just about to clean up. Go put your gloves on, get your Lysol, get your Clorox wipes, and clean up with us. Your house probably dirty too. Mirror, mirror on the wall. I love this mirror. This mirror is life size, life size. This is like the one part of my room that I feel like if this is dirty, then it makes the whole room look just a hot mess. But I did want to share this with y'all. So I have this Bible verse taped up on my vanity mirror so I can see it every morning when I'm getting ready. And it kind of helps me to start my day. It's from 1 Chronicles 29. It's um, a prayer of David. I think they were building a temple or something and everybody was like giving their gifts for the temple. But I really like this one. It helps me start my day. And maybe it can help you start yours. Just wanted to share. Okay, I just realized that I didn't read it to y'all. I guess it would be helpful for me to read it. It says, praise be to you, Lord, the God of our father Israel from everlasting to everlasting. Yours, Lord, is the greatness and the power and the glory and the majesty and the splendor for everything in heaven and earth is yours. Yours, Lord, is the kingdom. You are exalted as head over all. Wealth and honor come from you. You are the ruler of all things. In your hands are strength and power to exalt and give strength to all. Now, our God, we give thanks and praise your glorious name. Amen. I like to read that every morning. Makes me feel good. It's like my favorite thing to clean up with. Ajax with bleach. I use common sometimes too. Aries found this stuff right here. It's like liquid Ajax. This is good too. I clean, I, I clean up with like a, a cleaning bomb. I put all this stuff down. I be in here about to die. Aries come by and turns the fan on, comet foam, I spray all this. All these things that you just seen, that's what I'm cleaning up with. So if you come in here, you might need a gas mask because you might pass out, you know what I'm saying? Because it's so fumey and chemically, you might die. But I'm getting old, y'all. So I can't clean like I used to. I can't be bent over like this, scrubbing, my back start hurting. It's just not the way to go anymore so my wife bought me one of these things right here this extended scrub brush so now all I got to do is hit the power button you see that then I can change the speed on the handle slow it down speed it up and I just Get the scrub it in the Yeah, I can see how it works. Seriously though, whoever owned this house before us, terrible. Cause the tile that's in that shower is hideous. Like who came, who thought of that? Who authorized that? Who told you you could put that in your bathroom? Cause I would never pick that. It looks hideous. It's like four different color browns. It's ugly. Y'all watch this. Two guns, baby. Y'all want to see a dead body? Man, look at this. I was doing a video for Instagram the other day and had to take my phone to the ceiling. Look at the damage. It's ridiculous, right? Every time I walk by, I think it's a bug. Brave and Wish were like, what happened to the ceiling? 
That junk tore the paint off our whole ceiling, y'all. This is the culprit. Electrical tape. Don't ever put this tape on your wall unless you want to have to repaint. Damage, damage that you caused me. Look at this. Y'all, if I let that, I need to, I need to get some dye. Cause it is real. Them grays are graying, baby. They coming up in my head, y'all. I told you, I like Ajax, but I like coming too. I just go to the Dollar Tree and I just get like 20 bottles of Ajax, 20 bottles of Comet, um, and then we got this other Ajax too. This one is pink, y'all. They got blue, they got pink, they got green. And the green one smells the best, but this one is good too. So I'm about to clean this toilet out and clean this half bathroom downstairs. We gotta clean this mirror. We gotta clean this mirror. And we got to clean this beautiful black woman right here. You know what I'm saying? So we gonna grab this. Oh, trusty Windex. Oh, trusty Windex. Don't be bringing that no name brand window clean up in here, baby. Windex. Windex. We got a system, y'all. She loads, I put them away. It's simple. Teamwork makes a dream work. She loads, I put them away. Y'all see what I'm saying? She wash and load and I unload. She doing her thing to me. You look so happy. I always tell her, y'all, we have healthy competitions about how she don't know how to load the dishwasher right. And she always tells me I don't. Who else fights about the dishwasher? Is this normal married couple rhetoric? You can't load the dishwasher like me. I'm the best. <laughs> we coming down to the final countdown, y'all. Now I'm gonna show y'all what I'm about to make for dinner. If you don't have an SOS pad, baby, these get out all the grit and the grime. Like you see this dirty spot right there? Look at that. Adios, dirt spot. It's gone from the SOS. Y'all, the microwave got to get clean too, you know what I'm saying? Cause that thing be dirty. You eating up seafood, it might smell like old roast and old macaroni and cheese. You got to clean the microwave too. So we got old trusty here. Y'all remember this from the potatoes. This is probably like my favorite cooking dish in the kitchen. It's heavy, it's durable, but we about to make some baked chicken and I'm about to show you how to make it real quick. Whole young chicken. You see it. It's a 5.7 pounder. Nice little young chicken. We gonna throw on the latex. These latex gloves too small, y'all. We got the wrong size and they don't fit. So I got to squeeze my big old hands. Into these gloves. And I'm gonna show you what to do with this chicken. Look at this y'all. And I, oh. Look how stupid this is. <laughs> but anyway, 
Let's get this chicken on this cutting board, like so, like, huh? Brand new fillet knife. And we gonna fillet that chicken right down the middle. Bam, you see how that knife's going through that chicken? And just split that chicken in half. That's what you want it to be. Take the knife, cut the chicken right down the middle. Two half pieces of chicken. Now let's season them up. I don't know about you, but I don't like boring chicken. So we are gonna go in with the granulated garlic, sweet paprika, trusty old black pepper, caramelized onion butter, kinders, adobo. Some EVOO, some extra virgin olive oil, just to slather that bird up. Let's go in with this olive oil. We just wanna sprinkle this over this chicken. The kinders, pour that over that. You wanna get a healthy amount, cause we gonna crisp this bird up in that iron skillet, throw that paprika on there, throw this garlic powder on there. We gotta do both sides. Adobo. Rub this seasoning in. in a minute, just hang tight. Go ahead and flip it. But this is what's probably darker. See that? Right, that's what you're going. Later that same evening. Yeah, look at this chicken. This is what this chicken is supposed to look like. You see what I'm saying? You see that crust? Like that chicken is about to be succulent and juicy, and you're gonna want to eat the bone. Get into it, yeah. Say hi to the first baby, y'all. Hmm. <laughs> say hi to the second baby. You're not gonna say hi. Hi. Look at your glasses. I can't even see your eyes. This is my first baby. <laughs> Me and my little sous chef. Hold on, first let's let's see her outfit. Oh, you got on nice pants. Oh, you look so cute. You look so cute. All right, look. She wants to cook her noodles. So let's get it. Do we like Hold them just like that. I want to like just drop them in. Who make the best chicken in the world? Daddy. The chicken is already out the oven. Everybody's already asking for another piece. Well, actually, it's just um, his firstborn baby, cause she loved meat. All right, you gotta taste it on. Taste it on camera. Mm -hmm. Two, two thumbs up. So it's a wrap, cause we about to get into this. The noodles done. We about to eat some salad. We'll catch y'all on the next video. Bye. Say bye. Bye. We are a part of the Good Vibe Nation.